There are three ways to spell the word buy and they all have different meanings. There is the by, which means by bus, or I stood by the tree. There is the buy, when you buy something from a shop. And there is the buy that you use when you say goodbye, or when your team has a buy and doesn't play. You will notice that even though they have different meanings and are spelt differently, they all have the same two sounds, B, I. You will also notice that they all have a B and that they all have a Y. The by, when you stood by the tree or you went by bus, is the most commonly used by. It just has two letters, B and I, as in sky or fry or cry and fly. The buy, when you buy something from a shop, has a B and a Y, but in the middle it has a U. This is my trick for remembering that U. You have to buy a U in the middle of the word. The U and Y together represent the I sound, just like it does in the word guy. The by, when you say goodbye, or when your team has a by and doesn't play, also has a B and a Y, but there is a silent E at the end. This is my trick for remembering that silent E. You say goodbye to the E at the end, because you say goodbye at the end of visiting someone and the E is at the end of the word. Now you need to practice remembering the three different ways of writing by and their meanings. Take a piece of paper and at the top write by and say I stood by the tree. Underneath write by and say by a U in the middle and then write by and say goodbye to the E at the end. If you do this every day for a week, by the end of the week you should remember the three ways to write by and their meanings. Brought to you by Cracking the ABC Code.